Hello, I'm Joe Wren. Indiana health officials say they are cautiously optimistic that they have seen the last of H1N1 flu. The virus is still considered a pandemic by the World Health Organization and plans to reevaluate the situation next month. However, it has been a month since the last case in Indiana, and State Health Commissioner Greg Larkin says the feared third wave of the virus may not come after all. A former Columbus police officer is being held on $40,000 bond at the Bartholomew County Jail after turning himself in last week. Mark Williams, a 16-year veteran, faces six counts of forgery and one count of theft after it was alleged he forged family members' names in order to obtain prescription drugs. Williams resigned shortly after the investigation began in April of 2009. He is scheduled to appear in court this week for his initial hearing. The Bloomington Public Transportation Corporation will join other public transportation systems nationwide to promote the fifth annual National Dump the Pump, Dump the Pump Day on June 9th. The event encourages people to ride public transportation to save money, conserve gasoline, and help reduce greenhouse gases. The National Weather Service is confirming five tornado touchdowns in Indiana over the weekend. Surveying teams are still putting together reports, but early data suggests the strongest tornado touchdown in Miami County. Winds there were estimated as high as 165 miles per hour. The tornado damaged homes along a seven-mile path. Another tornado touched down in Carroll County and spun into Cass County. It was on the ground for about three miles, damaging buildings, including a hog barn. White County is also reporting tornado damage near Lake Freeman. No injuries were reported. In the weather forecast for tonight, partly cloudy with lows in the upper 50s. Tomorrow, cloudy and 80% chance of showers with highs in the upper 60s. Tomorrow night, cloudy. Again, the chance of rain continues with lows in the mid-60s. And then in the five-day forecast on Wednesday, mostly cloudy, a 40% chance of thunderstorms on Wednesday, 81 the high, clearing out on Thursday, partly cloudy, 82. Then highs back up into the upper 80s Friday, Saturday, and Sunday with a slight chance of thunderstorms. And for more on these stories and other local news, go to indianapublicmedia.org.